this video, I will explain about the law, but not criminal law or civil law. But I will explain it about electricity law, that is Ohm's law. So, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe in this video. Have you ever heard of Ohm's law? What is the Ohm's law? I will explain easily to all of you and how to calculate Ohm's law using Ohm's law to angel. So, don't skip this video. In electronic, some law must be known and studied for anyone in the electronic fields. The basic law is the Ohm's law. So, who is invented Ohm's law? So, let's look backward to 1827, where is the Germany people invented the Ohm's law. Ohm's law discovered by a German physics scientist in 1825. The name is George Simon Ohm. This is the man. George Simon Ohm published his finding in the journal. The title is The, the Galvanic Circuit Investigated Mathematically in 1827. In that journal, George Simon Ohm found that comparison between the potential difference in electric load with the electric current flowing in the electric load produce a constant number that is then called uh, electric resistance or resistance with R. To give the respect for this, that invention, the obstacle called Ohm with the Omega's object. George Simon Ohm said the current strain in a circuit is proportional to the voltage at the end of the circuit and inversely proportional to the resistance of the circuit. So, how to calculate Ohm's law? This is the easiest way to calculate Ohm's law. The formula for calculating the Ohm's law is that V for voltage, I for the current, and R for the resistance. So, the formula is V is equal I times R. Is right. The easiest way to solve the Ohm's law is using a toy angel. This is not basically a toy angel. This is a magic toy angel in the world, but it's not the illuminator. Okay, this is the Ohm's law toy angel. You can see. To, to find so, how to use the toy angel's Ohm's law? This is the easy. You must do the three steps. First step, if you want to find the voltage, you use this formula. V equal I times R, and you got the voltage. The second step, if you find to find if you to find the currents, you must use this formula. I equal volts divided a resistance and you get a current and the last step or the third step is to find the resistance is the same ways to find the current so this formula resistance equal volt divided a current so you got the resistance is it right okay guys that's all the discussion about Ohm's law so if you use the true angel we will be an expert so learning physics is easy right just do it never surrender keep trying if you like this video hit the thumbs up and share to and, and share it to all your friends and don't forget to subscribe this video before I close this video, I will give you some quotes from Albert Einstein. Albert Einstein said, important things is to never stop questioning. So, that's all for me. If you like it, just hit the thumbs up and share to everyone. Then don't forget to subscribe.
and see you to another videos wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh stay safe